Well, tonight, South Carolina, as expected, another number one seed, but a sports anchor, Amanda Keene, explains their path to a potential Final Four isn't without potential speed bumps. Well, Aaron, it was not guaranteed that the Gamecocks were going to get a number one seed in this tournament. And as we know, the path to the championship is not easy, so a number one seed certainly helps. But if you look at their bracket, they actually ended up in a pretty good spot. Things could have been much worse. And speaking of the I, I like our region. I would have said that if we were in any in the other region. Um, yeah, the tournament feels wide open. Um, that's why we feel good about where we are. Um, and we feel good about where we, you know, where we left off a, a week ago. Um, and, you know, no matter, no matter who you play, you're going to have to play, you know, and it's, you know, it's, it's the first round, it's the second round, it's, you know, as you advance into this tournament, it gets harder and harder. Well, the Gamecocks will leave tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. and head to San Antonio. And once they get there, they'll be in quarantine and in a bubble. Now, they won't leave their rooms for really anything except for practices and games. So that means you have to be mentally tough to get through this tournament. And they say they're in it for the long haul. With the Gamecocks, I'm Amanda Keene, Fox Carolina Sports.